This video is rated N for no one! Hi, I am Jeffu. I am excited to be here to talk about the new addition for the PlayStation lineup. PS5 Pro and how it advanced the gaming technology. But first, I want to take a look what it makes PlayStation 5 good in the first place and how it delivers an exceptional gaming experience. When PS5 debuted in 2020, there is a bunch of scalpers bought the console. With console power such as 8 core Zen 2 CPU core for the brain in the PlayStation 5, who wouldn't want to haul such a beast? It enables high speed complex gameplay and jiggle physics, reaching to its max potential and frame rate that can reach as high as 120 frames per second. Although we don't really care about that, 60 frames per second is all good. PS5 have a powerful RDNA2 GPU which can render anything to indicate details. Even the laggy performance Black Me Wukong renders smoothly with PS5. Ray tracing allows for the dramatic visual improvement, including reflection of the glossy body of Eve and the realism that comes to the realistic female design of a video game character. A custom SSD can load data at breathtaking speed, resulting in an ultra-fast transition between game world. and data streaming rates so high that the travel so speed is moving so fast Barry Allen can't even keep up. Tempest 3D Audio Tax brings an unparalleled sense of immersion to the sound of the game with audio so real that you may not need only fans to drop your pants. Finally, the dual sense. It has haptic feedback that let you feel through your hands what your character is experiencing inside the game. It's wonderful to see a variety of costumes to be picked in Stellar Blade and Lollipop Chainsaw. With the hardware capability of the PS5, it will look much more better and much more crispier. It is just so good. But as a player, I am so not sure why the creator are so into creating better leaf. Do you really care about a crispier looking leaf? Oh, look at that nature. Oh, look at that leaf. Yes, no, no. Now look at it again. We make it much more crispier. Just like KFC. The dream of a player is just to enjoy a great game with no bullshit like premium currency or concord. And to be honest, many players don't really care about frame rates that is higher than 60 frames per second, which led us to an aspect of the modern gaming that we know today, graphics mode. It could be a difficult choice for player to choose between Aerith or Tifa. Fidelity mode emphasizes the visual through high resolution rendering, so you can look at Aerith getting stabbed in 4K. This mode might also have enhanced detail or use more ray tracing, but the game only runs on 30 frames per second. The visual could be choppier, or should I say, stabbier. Performance mode emphasizes frame rates and interactivity, typically choosing to run 60 frames per second, mainly reducing the unnecessary political agenda until people don't give a fuck about frames because the game is so good. When asked to choose a side of the mode, player usually choose the right one because the character look much better. Making the character looks more alluring and more attractive is the purpose of PS5 Pro. We want to give the players the graphic that the game creator aspire to, 
the higher jig of physics that players have specifically chose and preferred. To do that, PlayStation 5 Pro substantially improved the PS5 in three ways. Here is what we call the big tree. First, we will make the GPU much larger and increase the speed of the memory it uses. The result is rendering it's up to 45% faster, so you can load a 3 second scene in 2 seconds. Whoa! Next, we made major upgrade to the ray tracing, taking a streamlined and accelerated approach to allow calculation of rays at double or even triple the speed of PlayStation 5 to allow more glossier ease to enjoy. And finally, we added custom hardware for machine learning and an AI library called PlayStation Spectre Super Resolution or PSSR. For players who enjoy playing games with keyboard and mouse because they enjoy their work so much they want to bring it back home and touch more keyboard and mouse at home, it is also known as the DLSS. PSSR analyzed the game pixel by pixel and add tremendous amount of detail to boost the effect of the resolution of the game. Game creators are adding PS5 Pro support to new and existing titles and with the big tree involved, the result will be pretty amazing. With graphics showing like fidelity levels at 60 frames per second, here is Final Fantasy VII Rebirth running on PlayStation 5 Pro. It has huge amount of details and it targets super smooth 60 frames per second. The graphic enhancement makes us one PS5 Pro to see that enhancement made to Tifa and Aerith. This goal to make games more lovable for players with enhanced graphical improvement and frame rates has been achieved through a bunch of talented studios like Square Enix, Shifop, and even Doragami Games. We can see PS5 Pro is blessed with such developers to keep players entertained with the power of PS5 Pro. So overall we can see some remarkable improvement to the games on the PS5 Pro. We can see sharpness to the graphics, smoother and more responsive gameplay. This is the big tree showing their value. As you've seen, machine learning, the PSSR library is being used quite broadly to add pixel details and boost frame rates, but there are as many approach as there are game engines. The increase in raw GPU power is being especially effective for games such as Stellar Blade and Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. Apart from the detail boost and extra graphic power is allowing for improvement to lightings and visual effects, as well as the hair and skins in the cinematics. Ray tracing is finding broad usage as well, particularly when the games are focused on higher frame rates. The faster hardware in PS5 Pro can make a real difference allowing Lollipop Chainsaw adding ray trace reflection between the tiles and the gameplay continuing to support targeting 60 frames per second. That boost in ray tracing also delivering big wins for game's characters, allowing not only for better reflection but also making your game's character more fair like snow and attractive. This is so irritating! I hope you enjoyed this DEI free approach that we are willing to consider for the future of the PS5 Pro games coming outward. We have heard your voice and simply just want to provide you with more high graphical qualities of games with more attractive characters in the future. PS5 Pro is the most powerful console Sony ever built to give you your best waifu experience as you can get and a worthy addition to the PS5 family. Let me wrap this up with a new look on a new console that will make your waifu look badass. So
only $69.99 because $69 is nice.